Hello and welcome to Dropped, the cooking show where three chefs test their culinary talents against our panel of judges and gravity. Of course, we wouldn't want to make it too easy on them, so they'll have to use our special secret ingredients in these dishes, because we need something to keep the ratings up. Now, meet our panel of judges handpicked from anyone with a mouth. First up, we have Natasha Vermillion, whose Food Network show, Fuck the Food, Will Just Drink the Wine, has been a hit amongst anyone sad enough to watch daytime television. Natasha hopes that her taste buds aren't too saturated with alcohol to taste the food. Up next, you know him, you love him, Guy Fieri, whose show Diners, Drive-Ins, and Dives is actually more trusted than Yelp reviews, Obama, and the concept of global warming. We just hope that his frosted tips don't freeze out the competitors. Welcome to Flavortown. Lastly is this moderately attractive person that we found in the streets, whose line of questioning went something like, What are you doing? I don't want to judge a cooking show, and is that Guy Fieri? The fact that he's still alive means that he has years of eating experience and is following our orders. Your secret ingredient is... A brick. This is perfect. My five-star New York restaurant serves a fantastic brick tartare. On top of that, my wife has a modeling career. Oh, 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 oh. Hey, when I was coming up through this system, I had to meet a lot of assholes. A lot of assholes with dicks. And I got two of them in the competition with me. And they think they can match me? They can match my talent? <laughs> no, because my Alaskan brick cod is going to be fire. It's going to make them wet. It's a brick, right? People don't. Eat that. The chefs are working hard to get their dishes put together, but what'll happen when we reveal the second ingredient? Alright chefs, it's time for your second ingredient. And it is... Spaghetti. Spaghetti? I haven't cooked anything this peasant class since I was nearly five. Or, 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 or cooked for Will Smith's lame son. Carol is going to leave me if I can't bring this home! Yeah, I don't track what ethnicity I am, since all that shit's through the patriarchy, but I never made no Italian. That's for damn sure. Uh, I can hang with that. Contestants, put down your cookware. Let's give the dishes to the judges. This competition is brought to you by the Donald Trump Foundation, meaning that the winner will receive a small prize of a million dollars to start, to use however they want to. Honestly, we don't even expect them to use it on cooking stuff. Most of the contestants just buy a lot of drugs, which we don't condone in any way. That's the real reason we don't show any winners after they win. They're all just fucking obliterated. Anyway, guys, you done? And the winner, with the only edible plate, is... Oh, <laughs> <laughs>